Hello everyone, my name is Jason from shootinguk.co.uk and I'm also a hookahbro.com member bringing another review. This time it's for another type of electronic shisha inhaler. Now, these time is what you call shisharette. And I'd just like to thank the guys from www.shisharette.co.uk for sending these out. I'm um, uh, much appreciated, um, but I would like to let the viewers know that I will be unbiased and balanced with this, okay? And I'll also let them know that this is not sponsored. Right, uh, these come, uh, you can get them in packs of five, they're 28 pounds, um, and for a single, it's eight pounds 99. Now they're each uh, up to 500 uh, puffs a go, uh, but that's for a two second puff. And it also mentions on their website that this is for a typical cigarette smoker to style puff. It's not for your average shisha smoker puff when you take a giant inhale. Right, the contents on the packet, um, it says there's no tar, no tobacco, uh, no nicotine, no ash, no leak, and it says includes five premium disposable electronic cigarettes and cartridge ingredients. Uh, it says fruit flavoring, uh, propylene glycerol, if I'm pronouncing that right, and water. I'll touch on that later. Um, but the flavours I've actually got to review, um, I have coconut, I have lemon, I have strawberry, I have cherry, and I have blueberry. Those are the ones I've got to review so far. Um, but there are quite a lot more um, available. Um, on the website it does actually say there's blueberry, strawberry, cherry, great apple, juicy peach, mango, melon, pineapple and pear, but I do have some other ones as, as I said. Um, but that is a very impressive range, I'd just like to say that, so quite impressed with that. This is a, we'll let you know, this is a very early product. Um, that, I was, they actually sent me an email saying the fact that um, they only just finished their packaging design. So, as again, it is very, very early um, in development, where it's only just been released. But it does come in tubes like this, um, inside this gigantic packet. Now, it does have um, quite a large warning label there, but I genuinely cannot be bothered to read it out for you. It's giant. But it just mentions that um, the shisha rate is available for 18 or over, um, but it does actually say it's not, you know, not, it should, should be used by people who are breastfeeding, etc., etc. Uh, and just explains how um, nicotine is dangerous. But obviously, this doesn't have nicotine in it. Right, I will be doing a two part review um, this being um, the product, and then I will do a second part, which is doing a flavour review. Um, just for part one to start off with. Now, as I said about the contents, but it does um, say there's that propylene glycerol. And it's quite nice to actually see a, a contents on these e-shisha products, I mean, it's not e um, electronic shisha products. E-shisha doesn't actually say um, their ingredients on theirs, but this one does. Now, I have to touch on this propane and glycerol, because I did actually look it up. There are websites saying, bad, bad, stay away, blah, blah, blah. But it is an ingredient that can be found in personal care products, i.e. shampoos, conditions, etc., and also some foods but it is genuinely recognised as safe by the Food and Drug Administration. Just like to say that, but it's one of those typical ingredients that they say you should avoid, but you know, one of those that people won't really, because it's not really toxic in small amounts. Um, in very, 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 very large amounts, can be mildly, apparently, but I suggest you do your own research on that, because there's a lot of it. But. As I say, I haven't found any negative things and I'm just going to continue using them myself. Um, right, but right, on to how you use it. Now, it comes in tubes like this and you pull it out and there's a little sticker there, safety sticker, if the camera will focus. Take that sticker off there, take the safety end off there. Now, it's actually a push button system, it's not a straight inhale. I would prefer it being a straight inhale, to be quite honest with you, but this isn't. 
But what you, that there is, I will include a little picture in a second um, for uh, what it, the product looks like. But what you do, you push a button there, and if you can hear it, that's it um, heating up because a little battery inside, and then you inhale. Now on the website there are inf there is information on how to use it. Um, it says simply release the button when you're done. Do not press longer than five seconds per in an inhalation, as the tip may get hot and a smaller liquid could leak. Blech. But it does get a little bit warm. But I haven't actually found this one to leak at all. Now, second part of the review. Now, I will do the flavour. This is actually a coconut flavour, which, which not a huge fan of coconut. We'll have to admit, especially the false coconut. Um, but I'll give it a go anyway. I have to admit, quite like the coconut. It is quite nice. Um, doesn't have much of an aftertaste. Slight a bit, but you tend to get that with coconut. Doesn't give a huge aftertaste. Toke is quite hard though. I will have to admit that the toke is hard. Still, quite pleasant though. I will let you know though, um, I have briefly tried the other um, sticks and they are easier to inhale. So I'm guessing the product does vary, um, vary a little bit of change from you know, stick to stick and flavor to flavor. So that's what I'm guessing. I say it is very, very early in development anyway. So still, I think it's quite tasty. Um, I'd say they give the flat clouds um, about eight out of 10, especially for an electronic shish inhaler, but it's still very tasty. Yes, one thing I would like to note, there isn't a limiter, as this is only a straight inhale product, there isn't a limiter like you would find in the other shooter inhalers if it was just a straight toke without actually having to press a button. So, as I say on the website, it does warn you don't have more than five seconds, which would be... So, still not bad though, still not bad. And um, say they are 500 inhales, and it does actually mention on the website um, you can be go up to 600, but 500, they're going to say that. So yeah, um, check out shishaet.co.uk um, and I will put a little link um, in the description section later. But I will give this a flavour, um, an 82%. Good clouds, good flavour. I would even put this in a shisha pipe if they did this in shisha tobacco. But the product itself, I would prefer it to be an easier toke and um, but it's still quite snazzy though so you get the little it's all you know it's pretty much all black thing and you get a little light up there which does look very snazzy especially if you took it out to a club and whatnot and it does say that you can use it anywhere um, because it is um, isn't actually tobacco or anything like that you're breathing out so you, it's one of those type of things you can actually smoke indoors like you could with a normal electronic cigarette but i will note though it does get warm in the end um, but I have actually used it quite a bit. It does actually mention as well, keep out of direct sunlight, we recommend you store your shisha at, um, in the vapor tube. Um, it comes in to stop evaporation. Fair enough. But yeah, um, I'd say flavor 82%, actual product, um, I would give anywhere between a 70 and 80. For this one anyway, obviously I think I'll probably up it slightly um, for the other ones, because you do get a better toke. You do get a better toke. Um, so, to be fair, I'd say 80% and a 82% for the flavour. So thank you very much for watching. My name is Jason from shishitinuk.co.uk and I'm a hookahpro.com member. Please give it a thumbs up. Ask me any questions you like down in the comment section there or post them on my website and I'll be glad to answer them. Um, and I will post up the rest of these flavours soon. So give us a thumbs up, comment, rate and subscribe. Thank you very much. Bye.